Hey guys, Bert Crown here coming at you with another YouTube video. We've had a great month of November, but with it being the end of the month, we're going to take a look at where the team's sitting. We're going to take a look at our strats because a lot of people have been asking me what my strats are. We're going to take a look at where our rivals progression has gone, you know, from where we sat in October. In October, we were division mid division three with uh, with like an 80, 87 overall team, I believe. You'd have to go back to check the video that I put up at the end of October. But let's go over our November team, guys, and check out that November progression. And if you do like the video, give it a thumbs up and maybe hit the sub button. 85% of the people that are watching these videos aren't subbed. It'd really mean a lot to me if you did enjoy the content to sub so you don't miss any in the future. But let's get into it, guys. So the first thing we'll look at is the strategies, and then we'll go, then we'll go to our rivals from there, and then we'll go to our team from there and see where the team's sitting after, after a month from our last October update. So what you're looking at is we run overload. We do not dump the puck. We carry it. We carry it in the zone. Um, the only time we really dump the puck in the zone is when people are playing the one four, and when you're coming up to the neutral zone, you see them stacked on the blue line. We will throw the puck around the boards and let our opposite winger catch it. Then that's the only time we do a dump. But we carry it in. We cycle. We got max energy just because you know we want we want a high motor team. We got a very stacked team, so not utilizing 100% of their effort all the time is uh, would be silly. And it's just gonna be stacked the same all the way down, right? Overload, 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 overload. And all the uh, the sliders are the exact same because we have, we have just a stacked team. So there's no point in playing anything different. We want all four lines reacting the same. So we know where everyone's gonna be at all times. And overload is just what I found works for me. Use what works for you. Then we'll go to defense, you know, hold the line and pinch. I just want to play neutral on that one. I don't uh, generally. I when they get the puck, I bounce to a defenseman right away, and I start I start moving based on what I see. Um, but yeah, and again, defensemen are all the same, so not much to talk about there. We're gonna to go to team team strategies now. We play weak side. Um, it's something that's been working for me. I do play the one four just because it makes it the hardest for players to get in. But with the breakout in this game, people. The only time the one four really shows up when people are breaking out on me is when uh, they backpedal to change their lines and whatnot. We play four check, not trap, protect the net, collapsing, and uh, our offense pressure is aggressive. But uh, yeah, guys, those are the strategies. That's how we uh, that's how we play our game. And and like I said, we were division three, so we're gonna go over and look at the progression of where we are now. Because we did change our strategies up um, in October, we were running behind the net. Now strategies were a little, little wonky. You didn't exactly know everything and what you were running until EA patched that. But uh, since we've changed to overload from behind the net, we have we've moved up from mid division three to almost mid division two. So we're making some good progression. I'm hoping by December I'm sitting sitting at like 1950, 1960 at a, at a steady right, like I. I don't want to go back. Like you're gonna have your roller coasters, you're gonna have your fluctuations. As long as I can stay in division two and keep pushing forward slowly, then I'll be okay. But that would be my December goal, 1950 would be a would be a good spot for me to hit. Let's look forward to that update. <laughs> I'm gonna chalk that one down as my my hopes. But division two guys, 1885, much better than the uh the 1740 we were rocking in October, so I'm ha I'm happy with my progression and that I'm getting better at the game. But with getting better at the game comes the team. And yes, we've got a very good team. We have flopped Matthews and McDavid. Their face-offs are pretty similar. Um, and McDavid's faster up the wing, so we did flop them around. Solani made this line. That, uh, that's one of the biggest additions uh, from the October video. And the team builders and Brett Hall, there's... Like this, this team is much different if you uh, if you watch the October update uh, than what it is now, and it is good. Tara Vinen, Tara Vinen and Jared McCann are still rocking together. Uh, Pasternak is not; he is he's been removed. Zabinajad took over with the new milestone update, and then uh, eighty eight Dion. He's going to be getting an update. Same with uh, same with Big Boy Joe and Brett Hall. Their updates are coming very soon. As it uh, is the end of the month, it'll be going to 89, 87, and 88, right? So there'll be slight upgrades there. And then we're just waiting for more Matthews and McDavid upgrades. And then our D-line, again, a lot different from what you've seen in October. 
except we've got Kale McCarr and Bowen Byram still. Um, we have upgraded with Steve Duchesne, OEL, Larry Murphy, and Mike Green. The team is, is looking very good. We didn't do any of the spreadsheet players because there is nowhere for them to go. The only thing that has not changed and that will not change all year long is the goalie. Jacob Markstrom will be staying right where he is all year and he'll be carrying our game count. And as of right now, guys, we have played almost 600 games. That does include squad battles uh, and challenges and whatnot. But in the month of November, I stopped focusing on squad battles and I just focused on rivals. I just want to play online games and get better at online. Squad battles is a different style, and I I feel like when you go to when you go to rivals and hut champs after playing a lot of squad battles, you don't play the online style you need to play to get more wins. So I've just focused on rivals. I want to get better at online play. If you watch my stream, Burt Crown eighty eight on Twitch every morning at seven thirty a.m. Eastern time, uh, you'll see that I just I don't do uh, I don't do any AI anymore. But that's the team, guys. I really hope you enjoyed the video. Uh, I really hope you enjoy the team. And, and I'm looking forward to making my goal at 1950 for the end of December's update video. And I would really, guys, like to have either Lemieux, Gretzky, or Nathan McKinnon X-Factor on my team. So I'm still going to push towards that. And remember, guys, if you're looking at your own team, just look at small, small improvements, right? Like month to month, look at where you're going. Just improve little bits by there, and you'll get better by the end of the year. And then you'll carry that on to next year. But I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, thumbs up. Until next time, guys, ciao, ciao.